Uh, would you feel comfortable telling the chat about your amazing hair? Because you have amazing hair. What do you want to know? I don't know. It's amazing. I love it. Yeah. I tried, I've tried growing it out, and this is just me, so I'm just kind of... Right. Actually, I'm kind of curious, because chat had me go over this a little while. What's your morning hair routine like? I wake <laughs> up and maybe do this, and then it's done. <laughs> Wait, your hair just does that? You don't have to put, like, lots put, of products in it? Uh, well, so it's like, say if I wash it, right, and then yeah. I put the product in it, and yeah. then the next morning I, I wake up, it's usually got... A, it's better the next day almost. So uh -huh. yeah, so I just kind of make sure it doesn't look totally like a bird's nest. So yeah. That, like I'm, I'm, a, I'm a shower in the morning person rather yeah. than a shower in the evening. I know it's a heat yeah. issue or whatever. But I just do that tiny bit of product and then like kind of yeah. like one swirl and I'm done. I'm out the door. Yeah. That's easy. It's, it's, yeah. We are truly blessed. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> yeah Tabby, I, I have a feeling they're Tabitha? Tab, tab, which would you Either prefer? or. Either or. You could call me Tabby since it's shorter, one syllable. I'm just meeting you though. I want to. You know, I want to get it right. Uh, I feel like you, like me, are a, a strong proponent of the shower cap. Yes. So you don't have to do your hair every right. day. Right. Especially if you. I, I usually have it all crazy colors, but right now I just have a little bit of crazy color. But the less you wash it, the more the longer the color stays. So mm -hmm. yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So shower cap. I uh yeah, I work under the idea that like if I just keep the same hairstyle for like a really really long time your hair kind of figures it out after yes. a while mm -hmm. and then uh and it's kind of it's like okay fine we'll just do this yes uh, i uh i finally found the hair that i like and here i am because i had long hair a long time ago and it just wasn't me i i, I feel very similarly yeah. i i was like what if i'd grow my hair long and then i was like no and then i got an undercut and i had an undercut for a while mm -hmm. and, and i was like i was growing it out again because i was like i was like ah, i feel like a change my hairdresser was like, are you growing your hair out? What do you want? And I was like, I don't even know. <laughs> She's like, do you want a bob? And I was like, no. She's like, well, what do you want me to do? I was like, I don't know, just bust me up. And she was just like, <laughs> I have a good relationship with my hairdresser, yes. though. Because the first time I saw her, I had exceptionally long hair. And I was like, I would like you to give me an undercut. And yes. she was like, are you serious? And I was like, yes. yes. She was like, you, you, you. Really? And I was like, hell yeah. She was like, Boom. and after that, she knew I would never get mad at her for anything. Yeah. yeah. Uh, the, the, when I got this back. haircut, I, I promised my hairdresser, I was like, I will pay you ahead of time if you want. Like, I know that I've never gotten any, I'd never gotten anything different in all the years that I'd seen him until I got this. And I was just like, do whatever you want. I'll pay you in advance. Yeah. I promise I won't be mad. Kind of thing. Uh, yeah, I wonder, I wonder if, like, uh, if hairdressers, like, have, start, you know, you get, like the policy of like if it's going to be a particularly crazy hairdo, like money up front. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> if you seem like you're going to be sign difficult, this, sign this waiver. <laughs>